Genes are made up of DNA, which is made up of bases called A, T, G, and C. A always pairs with T, and G always pairs with C. This order spells out the exact instructions required to create a particular organism with its own unique traits. The DNA bases are organized like a twisted ladder with the bonds between the rungs that can be unzipped like a zipper. A single strand of DNA is made up of many bases and every three bases encode an amino acid which form an amino acid chain. The chain that makes up the MECP2 protein is made up of almost 500 amino acids. Although genes get a lot of attention, it's the proteins that perform most life functions and make up the majority of cellular structures. Chemical properties that distinguish the 20 different amino acids cause the chains to fold up into specific three-dimensional structures, which define their particular functions in the cell. A gene mutation is a permanent change in the DNA sequence. Mutations range in size from only one base to a large segment of DNA comprising many genes. By changing a gene's instructions for making a protein, a mutation can cause the protein to malfunction or to be missing entirely. Mutations fall under several categories. Missense mutation. This type of mutation is a change in one DNA base pair that results in the substitution of one amino acid for another. For example, in the most common RET mutation at base 473, there should have been a C base, but due to the mutation there is now a T. This results in a different amino acid being encoded. At amino acid number 158, there should have been a threonine, but now there is a methionine. The name for this mutation is known as T158M. This simple change of only one amino acid out of almost 500 amino acids makes the protein dysfunctional. Nonsense mutation. A nonsense mutation is also a change in one DNA base pair. Instead of substituting one amino acid for another, the altered DNA sequence prematurely signals the cell to stop building a protein. This type of mutation results in a shortened protein that will function improperly or not at all. The X denotes a mutation that results in a prematurely truncated protein. Frame shift mutation. This type of mutation occurs when the addition or loss of DNA bases changes a gene's reading frame. A reading frame consists of groups of three bases that each encode for one amino acid. A frame shift mutation shifts the grouping of these bases and changes the code for amino acids. As in the case of nonsense mutations, parts of the protein that are downstream of a frame shift mutation are rendered non-functional. Insertions, deletions, and duplications can all be frame shift mutations.